Thank you. Just want y'all to see these mansions. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, door? He's in the truck. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. He was sitting in the truck. All right, let me take a photo. I can't tell too much business, but um, a few basketball players live over here. My mom used to work for one. I will tell you that name because she doesn't work for him anymore. Shaquille O'Neal. Um, fun fact. Um, but I can't tell y'all where people live just in case you don't know. And then somebody's watching this video will start stalking people. But if you know about where I live in Florida, then you know where I am. Like, I'm, I, I live right by here. But I ain't got that kind of money, honey. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You see this? Yeah, that looks pretty. It's pretty? Yeah. I wish we had one. Oh, no, I don't want a house that big, honey. No, ma'am. Do you know how much cleaning you got to do? Like a hundred? Girl. That, that would be... And then if you pay a maid, that's more money you got to spend to pay the maid, honey. Yeah, I'm Yes, baby. baby. I've always said that. Now, when I was younger, of course, all young kids be like, oh, I want me a mansion. I want me a mansion. Um, Hold on, I got to remember how to get out of here. I think it's this way, yes. I'm looking for the troll bridge. I call it the troll bridge. Um, but yeah, I know. I've always said I just want something just enough for me and my children. I don't want nothing too big. I made the wrong turn. Security finishing somebody looking for me. I already know it. Look at the children. Oh my gosh. Because I'm I'm in here too long. You can't be in here but a certain amount of time. Like, and this is my first time even door dashing over here, but I know that you can't be out here a certain amount of time. I need to use GPS real quick. Um, I'll be back, y'all. Look at the children. Maybe they can tell me. Excuse me. Can you tell me how to get out of here? I'm with door. I'm with DoorDash. I have no idea. I'm trying to get back to the main road. I'm doing DoorDash, but I I don't remember any of this. Straight down this road. Yes. There's the troll bridge that I was talking about. Okay. Now I know where I am. So they're right when they told me to come this way. <laughs> I was looking for the troll bridge. Yep, you're right, Sully, because I see security. Oh, gosh. Hopefully I ain't in no mess. But I'm pretty sure they saw me on camera lost. I went walking in the neighborhood, knocking on people's doors trying to get pictures and autographs i wasn't doing any of that okay 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 but yeah um i was way younger when my mom oh are they opening this for me i guess so he's like yeah get your ass out of here you ain't got these kind of coins <laughs> yes indeed all right so liz ready to go home Honey's too sticky and gooey, Bobby. Honey's too sticky and gooey. So but it's good for your lungs, though. You take it. What? <laughs> I, I'm not the one that needs honey. What you mean, I take it? Yeah, you take it. Girl. All right, y'all. So I logged out of the Dasher app. I'm home free. Top flight security ain't get me. They ain't send their goons after me. So Liz, ready to go home. I've only made $63 within these couple of hours that I've worked. Um, I normally like to get to 100, but my baby's ready to go home and I'm tired because I've been up all night. So we're out. Toodles. Peace. It's 11.34 a.m. I didn't even know there was a Chipotle in this location. I went and checked the dumpster at Aldi's while I was out here in this plaza waiting on a dash to pop up and um 
Oh, I guess we gotta go this way. See, I don't even know how to go in. And then I declined one for four dollars and I think fifty cents for Dunkin'. And um, this one for Chipotle popped up six seventy five for three miles. And I was like, Chipotle. It was like it was showing that I was by it. I'm like, there's no Chipotle out here. And it, lo and behold, it was. Was this how they seat people in Chipotle? Okay. Okay, okay. Hi, right, DoorDash for Tyler, Whitehead. Tyler? Yes. And you know what? The funny thing is, I Thank you. Oh, that's the wrong one he got? Nah, it's two. It it's says two. two. Oh, he got two. Oh, okay. What kind of call box is this? Okay. Enter code. I think that's the right one. No, nope, the gate not open. Let me see. Okay, this one says hand it to customer. So I won't be authorized to take a picture on this one. Because I'm supposed to hand it to them. Now, if I was supposed to leave it, then I would have to take a picture. Okay. Ooh. Lizard. Let's see if they let me take a picture. Customer is not answering the door, um, but I'm walking off to my car and leaving their food there. Can't stay there all day, honey. And no, the thing didn't pop up for me to take a picture, but I think it's somewhere where I could put notes. I'm gonna check right now. Okay, let me drive out. Don't get spoiled or juices get hot, honey. Because when you order food, you need to be looking out for it. I cannot stand when people do that. I can't. It's a pet peeve <laughs> already. Let me see. Nope, they still ain't get their food. It's still on the porch. Oh, well. Oh, well. Okay, I'm gonna record myself going all the way at the gate because people say just because you do videos too, that don't mean you left the food. I guess they saying people gonna go back and get the food after they record a video, honey. Uh -uh, I ain't got time for all that. Gas wasting, time wasting for no darn meal when I'm out here making money, honey. Uh -uh. my behind out of this gate. Yeah, my son lived out here for a few years with his daddy. <clears throat> I actually took a picture by those mailboxes right there when I was pregnant with Soleil. Or was it Sarai? It had to be Soleil, I think. Oh, no. It's only about to be three. Maybe it was Sarai. I don't know, Chad. But okay, I'm out of this place. Let me see if I can pull up notes or something to let them know what happened. Okay, I'm just hanging up with DoorDash. I was on the phone with them 14 minutes on on hold about eight or nine of those minutes. She told me that um anytime that it says deliver, 
I mean, hand to them instead of leave at door and they don't answer. Excuse me, I burped. Um, she says, I do have to call DoorDash every time. She was like, basically, so there won't be any penalties against me. She didn't say penalties, but um, because there was a language barrier, but she said, so there won't be any problems because you don't know if the customer may say you didn't deliver the food. So, yeah, and that that's the longest call I've ever had with DoorDash. Normally, it's wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. It's really quick, like two minutes. I call, they pick up quick once I press the options to get to them, and I'm done. So, yeah, you got to call every time if they say hand it to them and they don't answer the door. And she said, um, yeah, it doesn't give you the option to take a video um, in the app when it says hand to them. And that's pro they probably know that a lot of people that want to steal from DoorDash. And that's why they choose hand to them and then don't answer the door on purpose. So they can say it was never delivered. But she said, I did the right thing by taking a video or picture in your personal phone, even though it doesn't give you an option to do it on the app. She said, I always do that. So, yeah. <laughs> It's 12.20 p.m. I just paused the dash real quick because weren't any popping up. I mean, like three popped up, but it was two for $2 for 3 point something miles. Another one for $3. They didn't make any sense. So I paused it and came here to the pawn shop really quick to see if they got any gold on sale. Let's see. Oh. Uh -oh. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm good. How are you? Uh, all right. I'm um, coming to look and see if you guys got any gold on sale. Uh, yeah. Tell my hell yeah, nah. <laughs> no, you don't. No, you don't. I will be the judge of that to see if it's a sale or not. That's fair. So what y'all got? See white gold. Oh, you gonna drop it to the price I want? <laughs> in the middle. Okay. I can't guarantee the price. Okay, okay. All right, that sounds like a deal. What you got? Yeah, that one's pretty. I can't believe how light it is. Okay, let me see that one. Get this one back and let me see that one. This is a regular little chain link. Yeah. Yeah, I know he ain't, yep, you can get that. It's pretty, but yeah, yeah he ain't finna negotiate. One, I would thought this one would have weight more than yeah, this one. Yeah, just by looking at it. That's yeah. what I thought. This one still has a little bit of weight to it, but it's 10 carat. Okay. And this one is pretty light, to be honest. Yeah, it is. That's cute. And this is a man's bracelet, but I think females can wear it, too. Like, yeah. Because I still rock my man's ring sometimes. Because I didn't think it was that small on him when I bought it. And it's a little big for me, but I can fit it maybe on my thumb or something. Or with another ring in front of it. Yeah. I'm so, trying to see what's been here. That's the one you're going to show him, right? The one? Yeah. Okay. This one and this one is the ones that I got to show him. Okay. To see if he'll negotiate with me. Yeah. Let me just see what else has been here a while. Okay. Okay, December. December. So, what's a while to you guys? Well, if it's been here over six months, they want it out. Yeah. It's like anything close to like five, six months is is a while. Okay. So, but you this guys one, still we could probably still do something since this one's December. We're already in what April, close to May. But you guys would still want profit for it, right? Yeah. Gotcha. Which makes sense, you know. Yeah. If you pawned it or sold it at a certain price, you got to get a little bit more than, you know, pawned it for. I mean, bought it, not sold yeah. it. Do you want me to check on this one or does it interest you at all? Any of them. If he, you know what I'm saying? You know yeah. my price. Okay. You know my price. So if it's anything over that, then yeah, y'all can keep that. Y'all can keep it. Mm. I can barely hear you. What's that like counterfeit money you fucking with? Oh, okay. It's been put up, but... So how are you trying to make me make extra money? I need some bank account. I don't know how to do none of that. You said I just need anybody using over the bank account. And then deposit an air account. I got my free food that was owed to me. My gizzards and livers. 
So I'm now resuming Dash. I'm about to go back to Dash. And I thought about it. I'm like, I'm hungry, but I don't want to keep spending money every day. And this man owed me food from a few weeks back. I said a couple weeks back, but it's probably been like three, four weeks. And he basically interrogated me. What did he look like? What's his name? What's this and what's that? Which is, it's his job. He should. You know, he should. He should. He should. Because anybody could just be making up anything. But he eventually gave me my pound. I was only owed a half a pound, but the owner said he'll give me a pound for making that mistake. And I wanted my pound. Shoot. I told him, I'll wait here while you call him. He was like, the owner don't come here, though. But the owner was here like three, four weeks ago. And I said, yeah. It was around that time. I said, you can call him. I'll wait. And he wouldn't call him, though. So, 